So dudes, welcome to Dark Deception. Now, I have played this game in my Halloween livestream. You can go check it out there if you want to. Or, you could stick around and watch this because I plan to start a new game here since throughout that livestream the game lagged a lot so you probably didn't see a lot. So, we're gonna play through it again and uh, see what happens. So let's see what happens when we click new game. Yep, restart all progress. Dark Deception. Mm, that is creepy going in. Anyways, if you do enjoy, you know what to do. But anyways, we're gonna hop in immediately and so you guys can understand the story. Since my mic was muted last time. It is done. Now, my faith lies in darkness. I already know everything up to number three, I believe. Hello. It's good to see. Uh, it's, like, it's not really that good to see you again. Hello. Beers. Oh, another one. How nice to have some company again. Mm -hmm. Come over here. Mm -hmm. Let's have a look at you. Eventually you'll get to... Me, love. You Whatever. Really do. So many fears. So many desires. I thought you'd be bigger. Hello, Beers. Confused. I know everything you've got hidden in that brain of yours. I know all the terrible things you've done. So many good intentions laid to waste. Hmm. I could see the regret eating away at your. If stomach. you don't know, Beers is going to be our guy throughout this oh, game. But now your time has come, and here you are, to grovel and beg. Mm -hmm. You can't go back. Oh my Only god, this monitor. Awaits you there now. I'm gonna have to fear fit. not, love. You've got potential. I see it in you. And I can help change your fate. But if you want a new life, you're going to have to suffer quite a bit to get it. Great. And if you've seen my uh, live if you've seen me play it on my live stream, you know that it's going to be a lot of suffering. Beerce's ballroom, the main the hub for the game. The powerful ring are hidden in nightmares behind each of these portals. Yeah, that's a Find lot them. of and portals. Five, six, seven, eight, eight, ten push. portals. Fail. God. And you'll find there are fates far worse than death awaiting you here. Yeah, just wait until you see the monsters we have to deal with. There is portal number one. Yeah, Beers right now doesn't really play much of an important role. She'll play a more important role role later. All right. Clock's ticking. Let's do this. First level. If you dudes enjoy, you know what to do. Let's hop straight into it. That's a lot of red. Monkey business. Oh boy. This first level is not that difficult, but it's I don't know. What a charming little yep. hotel. Bring back any memories. Oh, I didn't even know this. Breakfast and murder free every day until 10 a.m. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, if you ring this bell a certain number of times. Hello! How you doing, little guy? Yeah, these monkeys look nice, but trust me, they will not be nice. Yep! Little jump scare, but I already know. Hello there, Mr. Monkey. You'll be- you'll soon find that these monkeys are really horrifying. You'll see soon enough in these elevators. Why are there so many? Whatever. Takes a while. So basically the goal of this game is that we're supposed to run around a maze, collect soul shards, and it'll allow us to gr grab a piece of a ring, which is supposed to help us fulfill our deepest, darkest wishes. Now, I don't know why. I mean, I'm pretty sure that'll become... Uh, I'm pretty sure the answers to that will become clearer as the game goes on, but as of right now, we have no idea why we're here or what our character wants. All right. See those floating bits I'll listen to the t you. I'll I'll let the tutorial play so you guys can hear it. Of human spirit scattered throughout the halls of this little maze. Mm -hmm. Each crystal is a remnant of one who has met their end here. Wait. So the crystals are a remnant. Does that mean one crystal equals one soul? 
One more thing. Or does one, one crystal one combined with there others make up a single soul? I don't know how the I don't know how yeah, the shards they work. This. They're just a collector's item that I need to collect. Two hundred eighty nine. So that's fun. Disappoint me here. A very clever girl. <coughs> mm. Just not a very fast runner. Mm. Enough instruction. Break those boards and let's get this party started. Let's begin. Let's get this party started. Yeah, you're gonna want to steer clear of those footsteps. Those are the monsters that you have to deal with in this little maze. Enemies revealed. Now we can see where they are. That definitely makes me feel more comfortable. Secret! Oh, hello! Oh, this is new. I don't remember how I came to this place, but I will not play her game. I'll find my own way out. I had to leave the tablet behind, but she thinks I'm gone now. Frightening creatures roam this old hotel. There's something familiar about it all. It seems that I can sense things for some reason. It's as if this world wants to share its dark story with me. I don't want to hear it, but I can't shut it out. Wait, so is this the person that Beer said died like the last person that died whatever i'll figure it out later i can only record my thoughts on paper to help me clear my mind the monkeys i can sense their desires their souls whisper to me the ones in the kitchen frighten me the most the mutterings are random and no longer human but they are the most violent of wishes i've learned that the mortal souls of murderers are imprisoned inside each one in life they abandoned their humanity they gave in to their urge to kill they chose to become monsters now they continue on in this place as murderous monstrous murder monkeys <coughs> So are you telling me that... Oh, shit. Well, except death. Yep, dead. You're making it pretty easy to root for the monkeys. <laughs> Shut up, Beers. That was a, uh... I didn't mean for that death to occur, but... Oh, well. Let's get back into it. Okay, so we found that secret, but we... Accidentally imprisoned ourselves... They're chasing me. I gotta keep moving, otherwise I die. Alright, so we're just gonna ignore... I mean, I that death still counts in the grand scheme of the game, but I'm just ignoring it because I sacrificed myself to unlock a secret. <gasps> nope! Yeet! I'm out! Always keep running. Do not let yourself get cornered. It's hard to tell because you're in a maze, but still. Hey, another secret. Go me. Aye, I hear you. Let's keep running. I found a secret. I don't know if there was a note in there because I found a note in the other secret area, but you know what? I don't care. So, that, that begs the question. So, these m monkeys, they're, they're humans with, they're like... They have the souls of murderers inside of them. So, is this, like, is this hell? You know, like the seven rings of hell or something? I mean, it would make the most sense. But, I don't know. Yeah, shredded by monkeys with knives in their blades. In their hands. Hear you. I hear you! I, oh my god, I jumped, I jumped, I jumped, I, I jumped for a second and I got stuck. Keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running, keep running. I am very jumpy, you all know that, so when my camera shook and I stopped running, that's because I jumped.
that's that's there I can't see them so I'm just gonna have to run and hope to god that they don't murder me just keep running oh god Stunned! Eat it! Eat shit, you mon- you monsters! They're stunned now, they can't attack me, so I can- There was one over there. I'm dead. I'M DEAD! That's what you get for monkeying shit! <laughs> I'm gonna die multiple times. I've only collected about half. Shit. Oh, pff, I, I just made a grave mistake. Up. I'm going this way. Just keep running and don't let yourself get cornered, which is easier said than done. God, that made me jump. I am a scaredy cat, I know that. Technically, I'm not scared, I just jump at sudden things in a horror game. Yeah, this is sort of like an action horror game, pretty much. Shit, monkey's down there, I can't go that way. It up this way. Just keep moving. <sighs> Hungry, so are we. Ugh, that's creepy. Just keep moving. Yes, I know I'm not collecting shards, but it's better than getting shredded by mon murder monkeys. Did I already get this secret? I yes, I did. Keep moving. I didn't know if I got that secret, but when I opened the door and there was nothing there! Yes, I got the secret, so keep running. I don't know if these things are just chasing me, or if they're smart enough to know to cut me off. It's hard. It's hard to tell when you're just relying on footsteps! No, don't go that way. If I go that way, then that monkey's gonna catch up to me and I will get murdered. Twelve shards. Twelve shards left. God damn. Hey! I'm running! You! Oh god, they cornered me! Oh! Well, I was- I was dead no matter what happens. Like, there was one behind me, one in front of me, and then one where I went. If I went a full 180, I would have hit them again. Shit! That's not what I want. Oh, whatever. I'm not restarting from the beginning. You dudes don't want to see that. So we'll continue at last checkpoint. Obtaining S rank, I honestly don't care about obtaining S rank yet. Five shards left. Simple, right? Oh, you'd be surprised at how difficult it is. Oh boy. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! They're gonna fucking cut me off. They're gonna fucking cut me off! Dead already? <sighs> That's okay. Nobody liked you anyway. Shut up! Oh wow, you that was insulting, Beers. Uh, it's always this one last shard that's impossible for me to grab. Okay. Go! Make a break for it. Ah! 
Ha-ha! They weren't there! Oh, God, now we got this guy to deal with. Let's do this. I'm going to turn the corner and he's going to be right there. Yep! Keep running. No! Shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit! Shit, shit, shit! I know it seems like I'm running around with just one monkey behind me, but there's one block in the entrance. Oh, now you're chasing me! You couldn't chase me five seconds ago? Stupid monkeys! Now I gotta go all the way back around again! Why can't I get out? Damn it! These guys don't give up easily! Oh my god, you're fucking there again! And you're fucking there too! How am I supposed to- How many are there? Jesus Christ! How many are there? Much, much, much later. Finally! I hate those monkeys. I hate the monkeys. Eat it. Hey, buddy. Yeah, he knows I'm here now. I need, I need to leave now. You will not believe how many times I've died to those monkeys. I don't even know if that's supposed to happen. Oh God, hi, hi. Okay. Okay. Uh, if you see my thing, if you see my live stream, you know what's gonna happen. <coughs> Make a break for it. They all just spawned right behind me. There's no escape. Hey monkeys! Oh hi. Hey monkeys! I've got one thing to say. See you all in hell. Ah ah. Ugh. We're just gonna ignore the three- THREE DEATHS?! Oh right, checkpoint. Uh, I got an A rank, I'll take it. I'll take- I'll take it. Boom. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. <sighs> For level one and that was difficult. Hello, Beers. Good. You made it. And I see you met my friend sooner than I was expecting. Yep. Say hello to Malik. Beers. <laughs> Still so persistent after all this time. Mm. Do not listen to her, mortal. She's just using you. Give her the ring, and there will be consequences. Says the obviously evil guy. This is your only warning. And if you're Help warning her, and you will suffer. <sighs> Says the guy who's hiding behind a giant eyeball. Pay attention to him. His powers cannot reach you here. All right. Good. Piece. Place it on the table now. Okay, God. It's been so long. The ring is called the Riddle of Heaven. <laughs> An ironic name, don't you think? A little. The demon's power is contained inside it. The creature of infinite cruelty that you just met. Malik. Malik. Complete the ring. And you can use Malak's power to fulfill your darkest desires. Or so the legend goes. If you're basing all this off a legend, then I have a feeling things are going to go horribly sideways at the end. That's what I feel like. That's what I feel like is going to happen.
2,000 years later. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. Holy shit, that is horrifying. Now, I was gonna go ahead and play the second level today, but I played through it twice, and the game is deciding to be a pain in the ass, and, um... The portals, even though they, the game deletes the portals, they're still existent. So they murder me when I get to the final segment where Agatha chases me and I have to get to the portal. But there's a portal right there, so the moment the cutscene stops and Agatha starts chasing me, it murders me. So I literally, physically cannot win. So, I'm gonna end the video here, and I'm gonna record it again tomorrow or whatever day I have free and try and do episode 2 again, so episode 1 might be short, but honestly, I'm fine with it because I've been recording for two hours now, and I haven't been able to beat Agatha because the portals have generated in a way that is impossible, and eventually, and it, and it seems like no matter what, even if I try and, like, kill the portals by running through them and avoiding the blast, then the game will just automatically murder me once Agatha hits, like, the final fate, the final time when she chases me, so... <sighs> I'm gonna try and beat this little shit in the next episode. But for now, I'm gonna end this video here. If you dudes did enjoy, you already know what to do. Like, subscribe, all that stuff. I'm sorry that I, I said that I was gonna post this game in episodic form, so here it is. And uh, I'll try and beat Agatha the little shit in the next episode. So I hope you dudes enjoyed, and I'll see you on the next episode.